Welcome to Big Luxury. In this video, we are going to take a look at the comparison between Gulfstream G700 versus Gulfstream G800. Gulfstream G700 The price of Gulfstream G700 cost around $75 million. The G700 has a takeoff distance of just 6,250 feet and a reported landing distance of just 2,500 feet. Cabin length of Gulfstream G700 is 56 feet 11 inch and cabin height of 6 feet 3 inches. Gulfstream G700 features true circadian light to simulate the sunlight of your next time zone to help reduce the effect of jet lag additionally. The G700 has a maximum cabin altitude of just 4850 feet, one of the lowest cabin altitude to be found on a private jet, helping you sleep better and reduce the effect of jet lag. G700 is fitted with 20 of the largest windows in business aviation, flooding the interior with natural light to make the already large cabin feel even more spacious. The G700 features smooth Wi-Fi so that you can stay connected when you are in the air for hours at a time. Additionally, the Gulfstream design cabin view lets passenger track flight progress, display point of interest and provides passenger briefings. The G700 also features an all-new seat design. These seats are handcrafted for each aircraft and can be converted to ergonomic beds. This provides the passenger with utmost comfort. The G700 has a maximum capacity of 19 passenger in a sitting configuration and space for 13 passenger in a sleeping configuration. The cabin can be configured with up to 5 living spaces, so you will always be able to get some privacy from your fellow passengers. When on a long flight, typical layout includes a forward lavatory opposite the aircraft entryway, forward by spacious closet and a forwarded galley that is built around a 10 foot long countertop, providing ample space for a crew to prepare meals. The galley has room for a large sink, a full-size oven, a micro-oven, a big refrigerator, coffee makers and all the storage space you'll need to keep passengers and crew happy for 14 hours. Optional crew rest area can be placed as well. Then comes an entertainment zone that houses a 40-inch 4K monitor with immersive 3D sound from transducer built into the cabin sideway panels. Behind the entertainment lounge is a six-seat grouping for conference or dining, featuring a wireless smartphone charger built into the table. Throughout the impressive quiet cabin, you will find multiple charging ports and power outlets. The G700 offers many cabin layouts and seemingly endless finer detail. It can be equipped with a carved edge queen size bed opposite a full size dresser. The adjacent aft lap features two windows, a stand up closet, a large vanity, and an optional stand up shower. The lab also features in flight access to the pressurized 195 cubic foot baggage hold, which can convey 2,500 pounds at the front. The G700 features the Gulfstream Symmetric Flight Deck similar to other modern Gulfstream aircrafts. The Symmetric Flight Deck features the Active Control Side Stick for increased safety. Additionally, intuitive touch screen, avionics and phase of flight intelligence helps reduce pilot workload and aircraft startup time. The G700 can be fitted with Gulfstream Enhanced Flight Vision System, a nose mounted infrared camera and dual heads up display which helps to land the plane more easily even in poorer weather conditions. G700 is powered by twin Rolls-Royce Pearl 700 engines that are mounted on the rear of the jet. The thrust of these engines are able to push the aircraft to a maximum operating speed of Mach 0.925. The G700 is able to fly up to 7,500 nautical miles non-stop, meaning that departing from London, the G700 can reach about any continent without needing to refuel with a maximum cruising altitude of 51,000 feet. The Gulfstream is able to provide a smooth ride above bad weather conditions as well. When it comes to fixed costs, there are criteria that have been identified as the biggest contributor to the annual cost of operation. This cost includes crew salary, crew training, hangar, insurance management, and the additional miscellaneous fixed costs. Talking about variable costs, there are main factors like the cost of fuel, maintenance, engine overhaul, crew landing, and handling fees as well. With other various costs, all these variables are proportional to the number of hours flown. The Gulfstream G700 is very difficult to charter. The hourly cost of a Gulfstream G700 charter should be in the range of $13,000 to $15,000. While the G700 is still very difficult to charter, it is available to purchase. The purchase price of a Gulfstream G700 base model is $75 million before options and there are many options that you can select. On October 2021, Gulfstream unveiled the Gulfstream G800. The 40,800km range model with the G700 wing and Pearl 700 engines. 
offering four living areas and 16 windows, with deliveries which may start from 2023. Gulfstream G800 is priced at around $72 million. The aircraft dimensions includes a length of 99 feet 9 inches, a wingspan of 103 feet, and a height of 25 feet 6 inches. For many years, Gulfstream has led the business aviation industry with the commitment and continuous improvement, consistently setting new standards for safety, performance, innovation, and comfort. Talking about the cabin, the jet has four living areas as the base plan, with seating up to 17 passenger or sleep up to 10. This jet can be opted with three living areas. Health and safety enhancements include 100% fresh, never recirculated and never refiltered air. The company's award-winning predictive landing performance system providing pilots enhanced warning of potential runway excursions so they can adjust approaches easily. This jet has one of the lowest cabin altitude in the industry and is designed to be the quietest in business aviation. Natural light can easily enter through 16 panoramic oval windows. An amazing view can be enjoyed from the inside of the aircraft. The center console boasts a shared throttle quadrant, and general flight control is handled by side stick controlling, paired with an all modern fly by wire system. The symmetry flight deck avionics suit adds safety and efficiency to all phases of flight. The G800 ties you non stop to more destinations worldwide as you fly greater distances at maximum speeds. The more precious commodity of all Gulfstream's high-speed range advantage will save you up to 1.5 hours on flight longer than 6,500 nautical miles or 12,038 kilometers at max speed of Mach 0.925. The G800 is a marvel of performance and efficiency, as it can also fly for a globe spanning 8,000 nautical miles or 14,816 kilometers at Mach 0.85. This jet is powered by two powerful Pearl 700 Rolls-Royce engines. G800 has many features including the Gulfstream panoramic oval windows and symmetric flight deck with electronically linked active control side sticks and 10 touchscreen displays avionics boasts the predictive landing performance system for advanced warnings of runway issues. The G800 adds to this with the raft of vision system in a head-up unit that merges data into a single display. For the G400 and G800, they use the most evolved architecture specifically developed to ensure superior performance and safety while reducing weight and fuel consumptions. The flight screen with interface and an active control side stick making the controls more pilot-friendly. It is at the forefront of FBW technology supplying the most advanced flight control electronics in over 10,000 aircrafts worldwide. Gulfstream Flight Deck has revolutionized business aviation with considerable improvements in safety and efficiency. Between pilots through tactile cues, 10 touchscreen displays are the most extensive use in business aviation and work in sync with phase of flight intelligence to decrease the number of switches in the flight deck. While no official word on pricing has been released, reports suggest the new Gulfstream G800 comes with a price tag of around $72 million. When it comes to fixed costs, there are criteria that have been identified as the biggest contributor to the annual cost of operation. This cost includes crew salary, crew training, hangar, insurance management, and the additional miscellaneous fixed costs. Talking about variable costs, there are main factors like the cost of fuel, maintenance, engine overhaul, crew landing, and handling fees as well. With other various costs, all these variables are proportional to the number of hours flown. Customer deliveries for the G800 are anticipated to begin in 2023. There you have it. A comparison between Gulfstream G700 versus Gulfstream G800. So which one do you prefer? Do let us know in the comments below. As always, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our channel, Big Luxury.